Hi, I'm Selena Maestas, a defender of self-love and the founder of the Love You More Project. I believe that women should value their significance to this world. My quest is to help women understand their importance to this life, this space, and to themselves. It's been exciting building a community, a safe space for women to validate their feelings for wanting more out of life and guiding them to give self permission to be a priority. I believe the future of well-being is understanding who we are before the obligations and expectations drove us to this point of discontent. I believe the future of well-being is you. I believe we need to give ourselves permission to be a priority or at least be on the list and to nurture that little girl inside of you. It's time for her to shine. Love you more. We all had dreams as little girls. I know I did. And then one day I woke up married and unhappy, a mother and exhausted to the point of illness. And I realized I have no idea who I am or what I want out of life. What the hell happened? What I did know is that I was tired of playing a role of a woman trying to achieve perfection at the cost of my own health and sanity. I knew I wasn't the priority. I sure as heck wasn't living and I couldn't go on this way anymore. We may not realize it until we find ourselves living a life with unexplained pain points and patterns that recycle over and over until it lands us in the space where we don't know who we are and we know we don't want to live this way anymore. But we don't know what to do about it. In truth, we are all just little girls who grew up to be women still wanting to be seen, just as we are. We've been seeking this validation from someone outside of ourselves. In this journey, we've experienced self-doubt, guilt, and even apathy at our own existence. Apparently, we have forgotten how to save ourselves. We are responsible for our own well-being. We are responsible for our own happiness. And this is why I say love you more. More than what media tells you your role or your appearance should be more than the obligation to take care of all with a great cost to your own mental and physical health, more than the expectation of being perfect and the fear of failing at it. We all have a choice to love ourselves and nurture that little girl inside of us. We need to have her trust us again because when we do, your life will change. When you love you more, you will value yourself and your voice. You'll be able to shed that guilt of taking time for you. When you love you more, you'll have more energy and you'll also have patience for yourself, your kids, and the people around you. When you love you more, you'll begin to heal, you'll begin to smile, and you'll be able to feel love for the first time. Why do I believe that I'm the perfect speaker to open for Deepak Chopra? Well, his message of mind-body connection, consciousness, and love is a message that our world absolutely needs today. My message addresses one piece that's so very important that I find women have a hard time looking at, and that is valuing themselves. To look within, to grow, and to be open for what they need in order to nurture themselves, that inner child, and all the people that they love. Can you imagine what this world would be like if we were allowed to be who we are and take care of ourselves so that we can grow? It's a game changer. It's a world changer, and it's time for this message to be heard.